Greetings, kings, queens, knights, nobles of all kind. My name is Blue Raven, and welcome back to Paper Lily. Uh, as you may have seen from last episode, uh, we, uh, or I accidentally, hit give up. Um, so we are just going to go uh, and explore this area, and then we will eventually go back to uh, the area that we were in the episode. Um, but since we're here, uh, this, that tree is massive. Indeed it is. This probably marks the center of this place, which means this is where the search really begins. So we will go back to that area eventually, um, but uh, we will uh, just start going, just start exploring right here for now. Let's see. The roots of a massive tree. There's blue mushrooms everywhere. Yes. What's this way? I'm mean, gonna say this is the, the center, so I don't really know the center of what. Those are some <laughs> freaky looking statues. Oh. Hello, Mr. Candleman. It reads Exhibit closed indefinitely. If you have complaints, please direct them back to where they came from. Lovely. A tall vase. Reach inside? Sure, that. Nothing ever. Oh, okay. Obtained a coin. Cool. A realistic sculpture of a man with a candle for a head. What should I do? Um, I'll take the candle. Obtained lit candle. I'm sure that'll be used for something. Oh, poor guy. Can't live without his lit candle. The sculpture is either broken or unfinished. You can't really tell. Well, oh. I want to explore what's down the ladder first. Oh, more horrifying sculptures. A strange vase with even stranger contents. B blue paint. A strange sculpture. Well, yes. A strange sculpture. This one looks kind of cute. Looks kind of like a uh, mimic you. I hope I'm saying that right. The one looks like Pikachu, but he's like a paper bag. A strange sculpture. A strange, yes. All strange sculptures. This must be a huge sculpture hidden under the drape. Check under the drape. Sure. It looks like an unfinished sculpture of a lady. She looks like she's made of porcelain. Oh, that's all we get. Hey, you're moving. There's someone there. Grab their attention. Sure. Uh, on second thought, maybe we maybe we leave. Oh. Um. I don't even know if I had a chance to. Um. Let's see if we have a chance to run this time. Yes. Oh. Okay. I don't. I don't know. There surely has to be some way to get away, because there's that letter there. Uh, we'll try one more time. Yes. Yeah, I don't think you can. Okay. Well. We'll just go back up the ladder. And not worry about that right now. I'm sure that'll come in handy later. I wouldn't have anything in my inventory that would help me with that, would I? Uh, I mean, maybe table salt. Can I look from a statue of the sculpture house? Um, okay. Let's just keep going this way. See what we have to do. Okay. A little flower bed seems like something someone has dug here recently check it out sure oh obtained a coin cool okay i don't think there's anything else really to do here but the coin i'm sure will come in useful as they have in the past although to be fair actually we did eat the chips and we also died so maybe the coins won't be too useful either way i think that's all for this side uh so like I said, we'll come back to that little guy earlier or later. 
Uh, can I turn these off? Is that going to be another puzzle? A lamppost. I can't get behind it, so I don't think so. Okay. Uh, this looks like it would just lead the same way as I went, but no. Okay, it's definitely different. Oh, hello. A sign post. Red's Treehouse. Okay. Let's see what's here at Red's Treehouse. Uh, a strong lamp as opposed to a weak one. Oh, an interesting character appears. Oh, hello. Someone's there. Nobody has come in a long time. I hope you can make it over here. Can we light this? A strong lamp. It's not lit. Actually, hang on. Sometimes you have to, like, just do this. Okay, no. Nope. Oh. I was not even watching that. Move around to avoid the spikes. Yeah. Oh. A lot faster than I thought it was going to be. Ouch. Yeah. Try again. Skip. No, I want to try. I'm not going to, you know, we'll, we'll get it. We'll get it. All right. No. This might take a bit. I'm not skipping though. We are getting through this. Oh, I did it. What the? A trap? That was dangerous. Why are there traps here? Okay, good. I actually got through it. Nice. Hopefully there's not any more. Wait, huh? That doesn't make too much sense. Almost there. Be careful not to die. How much longer is this path? I'll wait till you get here. Huh. Oh. Oh dear. Huh. Everyone dies there. Oh well. Uh... That sucks. Okay, good. At least it doesn't. Okay. I, I'm glad at least it doesn't like just take you all the way back. Oh, okay. I almost had that one. I almost had it. But now I know where to go. Ooh. Okay. I, I thought it was going to be the last one to be honest with you. All right. But the corners after that one. I wonder if that was the last one. She said it close. Or he. I don't know. Uh, okay. 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 Nice. It's actually quite easy once you know where they're at. Where they're going. Yeah, see, I don't think this is how paths work. But sure. More traps. Yippee. Oof. Okay. Will you be okay? Maybe not. No, I will. It's fine. Yeah, I love being impaled multiple times over and over again on an endless path. It'll be fine. Oh. They double time that. That's crazy. That's a, that's a wild thing to just... Yeah, okay. You say everybody dies in the other one. I have a feeling uh, you just don't want anybody getting to you. Ooh. Oh, I wonder if it goes through the ones that I'm on. Hmm. So I might just have to just like, kind of just jot around it. Yep, I would say so. Ooh. Okay. Oh, I actually got it. Those yellow lights were scaring me. Okay, cool. Oh, finally. Is there anything in these? A bag filled with garbage, probably. It's tied 
Hard to check the contents. It's actually hard to check the contents. Okay. Uh, yep. Yeah. Okay. Hello. You made it. You must be really good at dodging spikes. Thank you. He seems friendly. I'm surprised you're talking to me this much. Talking is an important means of communicating. Yes, it is. Especially when you talk and actually read. Talking is an important means of communication, no? Well, yes, but you talk as well. I do. But you're... What exactly are you? My name is Rune, and I like runes. Do you have any runes? I don't. That's terrible. In the future, if you have any runes, please bring them to me. I will give you trinkets in exchange. Ooh, trinkets. Okay, so are you some kind of spirit? Not exactly. We've gone by many names in the past, but humans often refer to us as demons. Oh. What is your name? Lacey. Miss Lacey. Rare to see a human around here. How exciting. You are human, aren't you? Yes, you can tell. A little bit. A little bit. Some of us may have the appearance of a human, but it's easy to tell the difference with a real one. You, however. What about me? Even though you're human, you smell a bit like... I can't speak of them, but it's someone very bad. Who is it? It's a thousand years of bad luck to talk about it. Oh, please, I really need help. Um, I know that there's some... I know that there's something off about me. I did this ritual to find out what it is and how to fix it. I see. For a moment, I thought I might be possessed, but... Oh, nonsense. Possessions are an outdated concept. Then do you know what it could be? A curse. What? 99% of illnesses here are curses. What's the other 1%? What a silly question. There is no 1%. Wow. So it's just 100%. Do you know how I can lift this curse? You should seek red. Red lifts curses. How can I find red? Incidentally, this is Red's treehouse. Yeah, I saw the sign earlier. I guess I should check it out. Thank you, Rune. You're welcome, Miss Lacey. I like Rune. Rune's cool. Let's go check out Red's treehouse. Seems like there's nobody here. A large blue butterfly on display. It's kind of mesmerizing. Red also seems to like blue butterflies. I must be an etymologist. A red doll. Both eyes are colored in. I know this. It's a doll that helps you reach your wishes. You color in one eye when you make a wish, and the doll will grant will help grant it. In return, once you've reached your goal, you color in the other eye. Essentially giving the doll his sight back as gratitude. Oh wow. Hero reads a lot about this kind of stuff. I wonder what this person wishes was. A book filled with extensive research on all sorts of materials. There's also an AC adapter in the drawers. Take the AC adapter? Sure. Um, a furnace. Inside is a thing. Is this art? It looks like the carcass of a sculpture or of some sort. A simple chemistry set for mixing substances. Some pink plants. Some black mushrooms. Some purple mushrooms. Um, four small blue butterflies on display. They're somewhat mesmerizing. Some books about cursed trees. Read a passage. Sure. Despite their usually small size, cursed trees have a distinctive habit of extending their roots to a distance of up to 60 meters. Their roots extend even deeper underground. It is unknown how far they are able to reach before stopping. Okay. A small plant. The leaves look like they're tied in a bow. Um, what about this? Small notes on curse removal rituals. Take stone curse notes. Yes. Can I even use this for anything? Well, I guess we should find out. I don't think I can do anything to this tree. The tree filled with blue butterflies. Oh yeah, I think that's about it. Hello again, Miss Casey. Red wasn't there. Indeed, Red hasn't been in there for a long time. Why didn't you tell me? You didn't ask. That's fair. That's true, I suppose. Do you know of another way I could find Red? I do. Would you like to share it with me? Sure. 
There's a lighthouse to the north of the big tree. Red goes there a lot. Have you seen the big tree? It's very large. You can't miss it. Yes, I have. Well, you have to head north to reach the lighthouse, but it's quite a long walk. It's right past the lake. But the only way to go north from here is to go through the locked site. Locked site. Near the big tree is a locked gate. If you go through there, you'll be at the lake in no time. But it's quite dangerous in there. And you'll need a light since it's also very dark. I see. Thank you for all this information. I expected demons such as yourself to be more hostile. That is a fair expectation. One that you should keep. If anyone finds out you're human, they will kill you instantly. Oh. Take care. Cool. Good to know. Oh, nice. Okay. Is there anything over here, by the way? Ooh. There might just be. Or there's just nothing. And this is all just a waste of time. Cool. Alright, so we have the candle, so we will have light. So that shouldn't be a problem. And we need to head north, so. We're gonna take a do that. Is this, is this where we go? No, I guess so. Oh, this is cool. Wow. It almost feels peaceful being here. I wonder what that place in the distance is. Well, I don't see a lighthouse, so. I'm assuming that's not the place to go. Is there... Oh, this fell off. Empty lamp that fell from that post. Whatever was inside is gone. Can I find a use for this? Take empty lamp. Yes. Can I combine things? I don't... I don't know. But either way, let's get our objectives real quick. Seems like the only way north might be through the lot site. Okay. So we might have to go over here. Okay. A tree, a red tree. It stands out. Is there anything special about it? Um, hmm, there's a paper with something stuck to it. Take padlock key. Yes. Also a note taped onto the tree. Obtained a treasure hunter's note. This note reads, Ta-da! Only real professional tree huggers would be able to find this key. As expected from my best assistant, Tree Hunter Scout. Yes, we should think of a better name for ourselves. Assistant Tree Hunter Scout might be a bit too long. Hmm. Okay. I wonder if that was the key for the um, locked site. Might be out here finding secrets a bit easier than I was supposed to be. I'm going to go all the way around here. Because we came in through... Oh, huh? Okay. I've only been here for a little while, and I already have a lead. I really didn't th didn't think this would be where I might find my answers. Finally. A curse, huh? It sounds probable, but how did it happen? And who or what cursed me? And why? There's too many questions. I wonder if I can call Hero from here. Looks like I have no reception. Should I try anyways? Absolutely. It works. Lacey? Hero? Are you okay? How are you calling me? Are you back? Did you find out? Wait. Are you hurt? Do you need me to come here? There? Are you in danger? I swear I'll get one of those letters and meet you in a jiffy. But, Hero? I'm fine. Oh, thank goodness. It seems to be safe where I am right now, so I just tried calling you. And it worked. Huh. Doesn't make much sense. It doesn't, does it? Tell me everything. Where are you? I'm in a forest. A forest? You didn't pack bug spray. There's more dangerous things here than bugs. But don't worry. I've got it handled. I just need to find a light, and... I guess you know, lights attract bugs. Here, I don't care about tiny bugs. Just trying to lighten the mood. 
That's my job. Hmm. Don't use up all your battery now. Remember, you can use the flashlight from your phone if you need a light. Oh, okay. That's true. How could I forget? But it will use up my battery. I might not be able to call you again if, there, if that's the case. It's up to you to decide if you need it. All right. I'll go now. We've got this. Okay, but I have the candle though, so I don't think we have to use the flashlight on the phone. Also, Southwest Sculptor's House. We've been there. West is Red's Treehouse. South is Train Station. East is Locked Sight. Okay. So. I just go this way. Oh, there's three locks. A statue that looks out of place. A torn piece of paper seems to be stuck underneath. Take it. Yes. Obtain Tranger Hunter's letter. Then it reads, For Marzi, you found my note. I looked everywhere, but there doesn't seem to be any other path to head north other than this one. Not that I know of, at least. They locked it because of the primal attacks. Things were getting out of hand. Please be careful when crossing it. Luckily for you, I got my hands on the keys and hid them around this area. The first one should be taped to the back of a nearby tree. I got it. The tree's color is all wrong, so you can easily find it. The second one is in front of the weird sculptor's, sculptor's house. There's a row of flowers, uh, but one of them is actually a cactus. Okay. Last one's under a fake rug near the red docks. Just turn left when you see the sign. It's a bit hidden, but I believe in you. To the other side. Okay. All right, let's go find those. So we got the one at the tree, which is good. They said there's one at the docks and the other one was the sculptor's house. So I wonder if this is it. Is it right here? Harper seems to see, uh, take a closer look. There's a ladder, but the entrance is locked with a padlock. Okay. Well, we found something else, but not quite what we wanted to find. Um. Okay. The floor here is unusual. Oh. Oh. Okay. There's a key hidden here. Take padlock key. Yes. Okay, cool. So we did find that one. There's the note as well. Obtain treasure hunter's note. The note reads, what do you think? I think it, this is my best hiding spot yet. No one would search for something in plain sight. Indeed. All right. So now we just got to go to the sculptor's house and find that one. And then we can unlock the padlocks. A set of colorful flowers. I know said something about one of the plants being a cactus. I don't know if it has anything to do with this. I don't see anything out here. A cactus among a set of colorful flowers. Ah, <sighs> I checked all these. There seems to be something hidden inside this pot. But I guess my just luck is unfortunately very... Just... Wow. Obtain Treasure Hunter's Note 2. The note reads, you got it. Luckily, the creepy sculpture man never comes out, so he'll never know about this, this hiding spot. If you're extra brave, I also hid some coins inside his place. Ah, uh, yeah, I see it there. I'll be honest, I had to, I had to like look up like where to find that. So, like, I, you know, I'm not, uh, you know, I mean, I'm not ashamed of it. Like, it's, you know, I want, I want the content to go along you know smoothly and <laughs> just be a whole video of me just uh you know sitting here um trying to find one key uh but either way so we're gonna make our way back over here now and unlock this gate and we finally get all the keys First, I actually want to read uh, these real quick. The note reads, Due to the recent primal incident, we ask residents stupid enough to go inside to close the gate behind you. 
A gate locked with three padlocks. The warning side reads, no trespassing, risk of serious injury or death. Sounds like my kind of gate. A gate locked with three padlocks. Yes, I know. I want to, oh. I keep on forgetting I have to go in here and actually use them. All right. Well, we're going to explore what's behind this gate in the next episode. Uh, if you enjoyed this episode uh, and want to see more from me and my channel, uh, then make sure to hit that like button so I know that you did like it. And subscribe for more to see when I uh, upload and post more videos like this and other content that I made do on the channel. So thank you guys for watching. Uh, I'll see you all in the next one. Stay happy, stay healthy, and God bless.